what's going on guys welcome back to the channel uh check out what i just i just found i got this for you guys to make a nice cool video uh we're gonna um, be unboxing the uh blue streak and this little ba uh, battle master weapon pterodactyl type thing i am not even gonna try to pronounce that name so yeah that's not happening so uh let's do him first yeah let's put blue streak aside and let's take a look at this one first this is a little illustration in the back so he turns he's a he's an animal that turns into an axe he's a weapon these things are small they're small transformers they're not really big because they're meant to be weapons for the uh, for these types of transformers, and you already know it's put out by Hasbro. Um, oh, and he's an Autobot. This one's an Autobot. So let's open it up and see what we got. Uh, yeah, here we go. You already know I don't use that. Uh, put that aside. He comes with a little little special effect. Let's take a look at that. See, in these little holes, I didn't know that since the figures come with like little little pegs sticking out, you can put these on there and display them like like hit shots and stuff like that. I didn't know that. So. That's what that's there for, if you guys didn't know. Uh, let's see. Oh, okay. I say it's like this. Boom. There you go. See? They didn't even need instructions. Look. Boom. There you go. And then what you want to do is, you got this right here. Put it there. There you go. Ta-da. There you go. That's that's pretty much it. These guys are very simple, but they're still fun little accessories to have. You know, even though they're they're um there's not a lot of motion, barely any articulation, but it's not meant to be a a, a figure. It's just an accessory. It's an add-on to another figure. So and then we take this off. We Put the head back here, tuck that in, pull the legs out, there you go, and the wings, and you have a pterodactyl again, see, very easy, very easy transformation, not that hard, now let's take a look at his face, got a nice detail set up, got that mean look going on, ready for battle, Then he got his little feet. So let's get that into the camera. Wings go up and down like that. Very basic. Now I want to mention that I see how it has this blue in the wings and it stick out. Makes it very nice. I would like to see more of that in here. It looks too plain. From from my from my point of view, it's it's way, way too plain. What do you guys think? Because I would like to see more more detail in there. You got, they have the detail drawn, but it's not painted, so it gets lost after a while. You know. See, like even this right here, she has some type of paint. Have it give it more diversity on it, but you know, it is what it is. It's no problem. Although you could even use it as a gun too if you wanted to. Put it in there. Now you have a blaster. You know, make it up. Do what you want. So you can put the feet down, and then there you go. It's a blaster. Now is that axe? It's a blaster. You know, then you could take. Check this out. Boom! There you go. Look at that. There you go. 
That's your blast. See? Don't always, don't, don't always need to follow instructions. There you go. Make it up. It's your world. There you go. See? So, now that we got him all set up and ready to go, let's pull this down some. It's too high. There we go. Because I want you guys to see this. Let's move this aside. Here we go. This is the main event. Blue Streak. So, he's a, he's a, once again, Autobot. As you can see, that's the logo. Put up a Hasbro, Earth Rising. We got a nice illustration of him on the side with his blaster right there. Not the same one, but it could be. Uh, then we have some words and text. Within 15 uh, steps, you could turn him into a vehicle. Looks pretty cool. There you go. And then on this side, Optimus and Wheel Jack with the, the arc. Another logo. And your standard illustration on top of the box. So let's get him open. And let's see what we got. Sorry, hit the camera. There we go. Does it come with the illustration inside? Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Let's take a look at this first before anything. Oh, look. And you get this. Let's see what this is. Come on. Try not to tear the paper. There we go. Come on. It's almost there, guys. Hold on. Bear with me. There, there we go. Okay. Now, to my understanding... It came with this little red thing, as you can see right here, right? To my understanding, you put this here, and it tells you some type of code or something. I think that's what it's for. I think. Don't take my word for it, because I don't see nothing happening. Or is it backwards, like that? Huh. I know this thing does something. I just can't figure it out here at the moment never messed with one of these before all my other transformers that i picked up haven't had that so but it's fine let's put that there he can hold that we will put this aside for now and it's let's see he comes with three guns He's similar, he's similar to uh, Barricade. Uh, if y'all familiar with Barricade, his transformation. It's somewhat similar. I don't see a whole lot different, and I haven't even opened them fully yet. But we'll we'll get to that in a moment. Uh, let's see. Let's see what we have. Oh. More instructions and more paper. If you guys are into that, I don't, yeah, it's the same thing. If you mess with these long enough, they all start to get repetitive. Oh, see, look. Okay. So you use the little red thing, and it gives you coordinates and all this beautiful stuff. So you can find these little names on there, I'm, I'm assuming. I'm going to put that there for you guys. If you want to read it, go ahead and pause the video. And take your time and read that. So, there you go. 
that's what that's for along with this you put it there and you'll be able to read it and see the coordinations and stuff like that so that's that's fun to do uh let's open him up and see what we got oh no matter of matter of fact let's take the blasters out first let's see there we go. got one Two and three. Hmm. Standard blaster. I just wish they was just stop giving them a solid color. Give it some diversity. Give it some more colors. You know, make it interesting. Since you're going all the trouble to making these things, then you know, do a little bit more with the guns. You know, always just silver. The whole thing. Give it more color, you know. Make it more interesting. Oh, okay. And these don't connect together like Barricade's gun. So these are separate too. Okay. So let's put that aside. And let's take him out. So we're going to cut these little strings. go let's move all this little stuff out of the way and there he is and his robot form nice I like the color color variation from red to gray and black it's it makes him stand out oh oh that was not supposed to happen already that was not supposed to happen there we go okay he's back so like i was saying before he started to fall apart on me i like what the autobot stay uh logo is displayed in front of the hood it's it's nice nicely placed Kind of want to see like another one in the back here, a small one somewhere, like right there where the, uh, the gas tank is. So, I appreciate how they do these little see-through areas, make it look realistically. If you guys can see that on camera. Very nice. Color combination, it's, it's well, ooh, really? All right, so I guess we're doing it like that. Stay there. Um, color combination is 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 very well done, but once again, these little areas that are plain, at least a little little black in there, you know, give more detail, would be nice. Let's take a look at his head sculpt. Nicely green eyes go along with the silver. Very well done. So let's put him in his in his vehicle mode. Let's see what we got. So, uh, da, 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 da. there we go. Put that down. Pull that up. Go here. I'm telling you, after a while, these these toys become get to be the same. So it's really not that hard to to do. Hold on. Give me a second. Ooh. Yeah, there we go. Okay. That's fine. Oh, yeah, because the door goes here. In that little hinge right there. See, if you look at it, that little hinge goes in here. If you want to make sure you have it like that. Bring that up. There you go. Those little pegs go right there. Yeah, see here too. Right there. There you go. See how that snap? 
So now you got the front of the car. Come on. See, so his new, everything is still hard to move around. Okay, there we go. Then we grab his legs, tuck this in like so. We bend it, slap it on together like so. Then, oh, I'm messing something. Wait a minute. There we go. Ah, okay, yeah. I screwed up, I screwed up. Okay, so, pull that in, pull that in. And if we come this way. Okay, guys, um, I had to pause the video and then now I'm back. It, it was very, very annoying um, trying to get all the all, all him to fit. As you can see, those gaps there over here, too, as well. It, it, it just it kept popping out. It wouldn't it wouldn't stay firm or even so. I mean, it still moves. You know, it's fine. But it was just very annoying. I don't know if it's because it's new or mine came defective. I don't know. I don't know. But it was very annoying. So I it got to the point where I had to stop the video and then try to do it and then come back. So that's what happened. So no big deal. Um, still there. It's just one of those things where... I say it's, the, it's a defect from the manufacturer, as you can see. It's not closed all the way like it is here. So this will pop if you don't if you don't notch it here. There's a little hinge right here that holds the door. If you don't get it on there correctly, it will just keep on popping out every single time. So just be aware of that if you have that problem. It's just one of those things. But show must go on. So anyway. Um, this is him in his vehicle mode, fully transformed. Um, little critique, um, this right here, that red line, I understand that's part of his body, you know, being folded or whatever. I wish this would have some type of like tint or smoke to hide that so you don't have to see it because after a while it gets annoying. Um... Da, 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 da. would have been cool to see like a license plate like on the other ones you know how you have the little license plate and then put the transformer or the Autobot logo on there that'd be cool to see in the future Hasbro take that into account just saying um but other than that the figure is 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 well done well designed uh, as far as um color scheme goes you know, it's it's lightweight. Um, you don't have to turn the head around. You know, uh, I don't know if the instructions say I don't do it. You know, that's just me. Do as you wish. So uh, we could put the blasters. You see the little holes right there. You could put one in there. One in here. There you go. And then see pops out and they try to get it in it's like uh, it's frustrating at times but then you get that there see keeps popping out I don't know it's just, just the, this one it's it's like that I don't know these don't go all the way down in you can see in the camera it doesn't go down all the way so, but anywho, that's Blue Streak in his vehicle mode, right along with
the pterodactyl. Let's take this off. Put this here. We can set them up like that. Sort of like a sound wave. That's pretty interesting. Like so. Uh, let's do comparison. Um, I have a few. Uh, got barricade. Let's move this out of the way. Got barricade. I thought it was going to be the same thing. You know, since they look similar in the package, even in the bottom, the way the arms fold, the legs fold, but. Even even when you pop out the uh, the doors, you know, even the guns in the front, I th I thought it was the same, but it's not. You know, then let's bring in Red Alert. Let's move his gun there. Little blaster. That's all it is. Um. There you go. Wait, let's get all three into the camera. Give it a comparison to all three. They're unique in their own way, even though uh, they also transform in a in pretty much similar similar way. They have a lot of similarities, but they all transform in their own way, as you can see. <laughs> but um, anywho, um, let's... Right, let's put them in robot form and see how how high are they. Uh, 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 let's see. So he's not that tall, but we'll see. That's red alert. Then let's do him. Remove these. See, and then here, going back, pop that out. Pop that out. Then in here, you want to move these out of the way. Oh, wait. Like that. Arms up. See? Like that. Twist. Then. Oh, come on. Don't do this to me now. There you go. Then we do it like that. Pop these two. Drop that. Drop that. Really? All right. Oh no. Okay, it's fine. Uh. Da -da -da -da. Yeah, see, so they're about the same height. Let's put him aside for now. They're about the same height. Not much difference in height. Let's see the strain him out. Yeah, they're about the same height. Even though he has the doors open, blue straight, they're about the same height. Then let's bring in him. He's somewhat also the same. You gotta pop out the doors. Like so. Bring that up. Da 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 da. Got 
that. Maybe twist that. Onto there. Yeah, see, I thought it was going to be like that. You know, something very, like, simple. Just one, two, three, and then boom, there you go. So, but unfortunately, that's not the case with him, with uh, Blue Streak, but that's okay. Yeah, see, they're about the same height, too, as well. Yeah. So, nice comparison. Autobot and Insecticon, but they're about the same height. So... Not much difference there. Back to back. Let's see. Yeah, they're still the, they're still about the same height. And like I mentioned in the beginning, hold on, let's just put him there. All right, let's we could set him down. That's fine. We could take the pterodactyl. Do this. Put these away, the wings, and then that serves him as a weapon. Like so. Like that. See, and then in the green area, I mean, the you can set that here, like so. See, like that. If you want to go that route, you have that option, you can do it like that. It's up to you, play it how you want. Then, and if not, if you want to have it into a gun, just take that out. Take that out. Ooh, piece fell off. We're going to pop that back in. And now it's a gun. And now it's a gun, like so. So it's two weapons in one, depending on how you transform it. Um, you can put these on here, so he can have more guns. Uh, have a hammer too. It's another. another battle master it's the hammer you can put that on there like that if you want to do that it's up to you I just got different ones and different variety of all this stuff so make it up no big deal or hell look you can even switch Take this right here, take this out, boom, there you go. Like that. And now he's firing. So. Like I said, they're just accessories. You can swap out back and forth. No big deal. There's no right or wrong way to use them. They're just accessories. Even You can even put them on the figure itself. Like if they got hit, it'll be like a hit in the arm. See that little peg right there? Put the little hole. Boom, he got hit in the arm. That little peg right there. Boom, he got hit in the shoulder. Now he's hit twice. Yeah. To make it very interesting to 
mount, you know, if you want to display your characters or your figures, this is a good way to do it if you want to play with them like that. So, but anywho, um, that's, that's all I have for you guys today. Sorry that the video became so long. It was supposed to be something small, you know, in and out, something quick. But unfortunately, that was not the case. But thank you for bearing with me. This is the review for this character. For this uh, this figure. We're going to put that. Give them all back their guns. There you go. Um, that's all I have for you today. Um, as always, you know, subscribe, like, and share this video. Uh, put it in the comments. Let me see which blue streak you have or red alert or barricade. Um, there's tons of differentiations out there. So just hit me up. Let me know which one you like until next time, guys. See you.